design is one of the, one of the principal means of product differentiation. So if you have a series of products with similar performance characteristics, one of the principal uh, ways in which consumers differentiate or distinguish between them is the attractiveness of the design, of course. And the interesting thing about design is that when the technological possibilities of a field have been exhausted, design then becomes really the main way in which differentiation occurs. So take shoes, as Bin Ying has said, or chairs. There are not 57,000 ways of making shoes. You know, the technology of shoes is relatively speaking static. But design is, you know, enables change. Uh, enables differentiation. But similarly, and, and as I said, it's the interesting thing about designs, when it's a high-tech product, design can communicate function. It can tell you how, you know, it can serve as a set of operating instructions. So if you look at the microphone, you don't, ha you don't need a set of operating instructions to see that this is where you speak and that is the button that you press. The design tells you that. So it is a language for the product's functionality.